And welcome back to All Over the Map. Thanks for tuning in on this episode. We've got an Urban America, the game created by Orange Juice. It says, similar to Mappers, an urban world, this time with American towns and cities, all hand-chosen locations. Uh, so this should be fun. A lot of locations, uh, a good map. A lot of people played this, uh, and it was a requested game. So we're going to do this. We're going to do this game as a three-minute moving, painting, zooming, allowed challenge. As much as possible, I will try to do this as a uh, no-move challenge. I might have to move around a little bit, um, but uh, again, I'm going to start try to decipher this with uh, in a no-move format. Uh, so let's get into this. The play-along link will be in the description below. Hope everybody out there is doing well. And uh, off we go. If you could, hit the like button. We'd really appreciate it. And uh, let's go to an urban America. Okay, so that water tower looks like we're in the Midwest somewhere in the United States. Um, not as urban as I thought, as I'd like. A little small, seems like a small town, but I guess urban nonetheless. A small football stadium there. Um, looks like we might be a little further west than the actual Midwest. So let's take a look. I can't determine the location. Uh, we were in Oak Street from not moving, so we're going to move. Um, Western, yeah, it's just a... Okay, the homes, I mean, this looks further west. I said Midwest, this is probably quite further west than I thought. Um, two minutes to go. And we got Idaho plates, it looks like. So I gotta find some clues pretty fast here. A town Maverick. All right, what do we have here? Discover downtown, but well, that doesn't help. We know we're downtown. Um, Anita's. Buck and Bar. There's the state of Idaho there. Um, okay. Pretty flat where this is. K Town Fitness. Okay, Kimberly, Idaho. Well, that's going to be a small town. Um, probably down here somewhere, I think. There we are. There's Kimberly near Twin Falls. Pretty good. There's Oak. Uh, near the middle school. So, or the elementary school, I guess. There we are, 102 yards. We missed this perfect score by a point. Kimberly, Idaho. Um, the reason why I went south in Idaho is just because it looked flat. There's a lot of mountains and hills in Idaho. Um, but yeah, and the other reason why I went to further west, because um, the style of the homes didn't necessarily look as Midwest as I thought initially uh, with that water tower. Kimberly, Idaho. So that was interesting. So we go off to the south and palm trees in Panama City, Florida. Um, near the ocean at Harrison. It's on this says here. Springfield. Looking east at Harrison and 6th. Panama City, Florida on the Gulf of Mexico. Again, there's these big puffy clouds you oftentimes see near water. Um, I don't know, just seems that way to me. Something that I've noted uh, over the years, big puffy clouds close to water. 
So, 6th and Harrison in Panama City, Florida. Good spring break destination for a lot of people in the United States, especially college students. Um, this is, there we are, right there. 6th and Harrison with two minutes to go. You're on the south side of the street. Let's put it right there. And we've got Maddie's La Casita. And let's see which way is the beach. So we're looking, yeah, so the water is to the west and southwest, which is kind of off in that direction. Yeah, I guess the clouds, there's big puffy clouds. This one, you can't really tell. Um, but anyway, Panama City, Florida. Any perfect score for this one. Hopefully you got that one right. Let me get off to the next round. Um, okay, this look looking initially a little more northeast. I think there's a Jersey, well, no, maybe not Jersey plates. But I see this white pine tree, the style of homes. Um, that's my initial thought. But maybe not. Yeah, maybe this is, seems, those homes seem a little more Philly-ish, like, we're near train tracks. Still think these could be Jersey tags. Uh, if I had a guess right now, I'd go to probably like Camden, New Jersey. Um, but, and that's why we're looking here. That's why we're moving. Not enough clues. <laughs> so this big thing's being transported I gotta check something out real quick. Sorry. No. Uh, maybe it is. I can't tell. If that's being, this trailer's being carried by that car. That's crazy. Um, usually, let's go this way. Yeah, I think these are Jersey tags, New Jersey tags. Um, there's an Irish flag. Okay. Congrats, Shane, the class of 2022, and Michaela. Um, I guess the stadium or the high school field's probably down this way. And we should get some clues here with the ads. Gloucester City, New Jersey. Looks like some Irish... Irish community, Thomas Murphy's Pub, um, 856, Gloucester City, Gloucester City, Irish, 676, so yeah, maybe we are near Philly, 76, I think, There's, I saw Belmar, Gloucester City. What did I say? We're close to Camden, um, which is straight up. Let's see here. Let's go back here. Here, train tracks looking west. So maybe we're in like Railroad Avenue or something. At this point, not going to get the actual location, but Gloucester City. Well, there we go. 81 New Hards missed this one by a point. But where's Camden? And then it's up here. There it is. So that's pretty good grass. I mean, I'll be honest with you, just looking at the uh, train tracks, the types of homes, the style of homes, does it like what I call white pine trees, very uh, reminiscent of the Philadelphia metropolitan area, which I've been uh, quite a few times. Haven't been too much on this side of the river, but uh, nonetheless, there are Gloucester City. I guess there's the uh, Irish community uh, there. Fourth round, we got some tall buildings, newer buildings, and great clips. Get your hair cut. Adults, $18. Kids, 16 Or if you're a senior, get your hair cut. Uh, looks like New Jersey tags there again. Maybe this is Jersey City. It's the only place I think in New Jersey with buildings like this. Looking south. Yeah, I think 
yep, there's one world. There's where the one world tower is across the river. It is Jersey City. The waterfront, the Double Tree Club courtyard. I've actually been on this road right here. Um, and the, I think in one of the videos I was talking about tall buildings in Finland, the Goldman Sachs building is down here somewhere, I think south. But anyway, I don't want to get too carried away in this because we got a time limit. Um, what street is this? Minute 35, 4. Um, and we are Jersey. Jersey City. I think we're close to the water, too. All right, so we got Second Street in green. So we're in green. Columbus. There's the Goldman Sachs building I was talking about. There's green and second. So I think we're about there. There's the great clips. Get your hair cut. Like I said, I've been on this road before. I've uh, been through this area. Um, nice part. I think you can um, take the what I think is the path. Anybody familiar across from here? You can actually park here and go across, and that will take you over to the uh, southern Manhattan. It's a good place. You can park here and go into the city that way. Um, crap. Just realized talking and I think we're like here so one second to go hopefully got a there we go got a perfect score in that round 19 yards Jersey City New Jersey on in urban America so we get the fifth and final round and I feel like just looking at this the palm tree and these clouds coming up over this mountain and the homes this has to be Hawaii I, I gotta think this is Hawaii so let's figure this one out yeah this is Majestic mountains, palm trees, and those clouds. Because I don't think you see clouds like that in California coming over the mountain. Um, could be wrong, but I think this is Hawaii. So we got to figure out what uh, part of Hawaii this is. Neighborhood Crime Watch. A lot of a lot of uh, homes up on that hill. Hmm. I feel like we're just looping back to where we came from. Uh, a minute forty to go. Yikes, this isn't good. We need to find some good clues pretty fast and get out of this neighborhood. Um, I think the default would be, would be Honolulu, but I don't think, it doesn't mean that that's where we are. Uh... I want to go that way, but I can't. And 55 seconds. I think I might have to go to uh, just drop this one. And uh, see where this takes us. 
Jeez. Nothing like being stuck in a Hawaiian neighborhood uh, in this game with uh, limited time to go. Unfortunately, we're probably not going to get it. It's probably on a different island, and it is. <laughs> Lost a lot of points in that one. Um, ah, what a disappointing end to this game. Uh, so there we go. Hawaii, 97 miles. If you got that one, uh, that's good for you. Um, you let me know. you got to let me know if you got that round uh, with a perfect score. And what were the clues? Um, yeah, that was... The Mochi Boys. But yeah, that's one that uh, probably wouldn't have gotten in the time. Molokai Hilltop Condo. There's your Starbucks. There's your Hawaiian Shaved Ice, which is good. And your Chinese Barbecue. So there we go. In Hawaii, we got 23,970. It was on a pretty good pace there. We went from Idaho to Panama City, Florida to two rounds in New Jersey and Hawaii. So uh, if you like this game, hit, hit the like button. Uh, if you want me to play any games uh, like this or others that was that um, you want to request, I'll be happy to play it. And with that said, thanks for tuning in. Until next time, cheers.